the St. Francis U bowling team heads to the NECs to look to repeat as NEC champions. Right, right now, it, it, there's that old saying, survive and advance. I want to kind of take that to another level. It's like we want to, we want to play uh, our style uh, of matches. We want to bowl the way we bowl and, and try to uh, make a statement through this tournament. You know, we, we've had a tough first part of the year. We've had a great second half of the year. So we want to continue uh, the type of play that we've been uh, we've been experiencing and hopefully enjoy success. I mean, it's going to be a tough weekend, but we got to, we have to rise above it. It's a unique conference that way. Historically, if you look at it, the lower seeds tend to do well. We were fortunate last year to do what we did as a as a top seed, but uh, you know this year coming in as a fourth seed, you know we have our work to do. I mean, teams are getting better uh, coming into the season. Teams are getting better as you extend into the season, and, and th this conference is is no different. So uh, we're we're looking at this as a challenge. Uh, we're looking at this as a match by match. Um, type of scenario where, where we have to have our whole focus on what we're doing in the present. We've uh, really come together the last couple tournaments. We had a tremendous showing in Tennessee. Every, all the pieces are just falling together right now for us to defend our title like NEC championships. Uh, the expectations are higher than ever. You know, we, like I said, we set an amazing scoring pace last week in Tennessee, and you know, that doesn't change anything going into NECs. We expect the same scores coming in and you know, just dominate the opponents like we have been. Uh, just going back, the competition, the head-to-head, -head, and everybody that was there was here last year will be there this year again. And some people might be a little hurt over it, so there'll be we'll have a big target on our back. But I think we'll do pretty well this weekend.